Okay, so you can now launch Google Assistant from Hey Siri uh, using Siri shortcuts. Uh, now the first thing you need to do is to go into the App Store and search for the Google Assistant app, as you can see here. Uh, just download that uh, and uh, I'll speed this bit up. Okay, so we'll open that app up uh, and then what you're looking for on the bottom right hand corner, um, well let's just skip past this. So accept the, uh, the various different things that it asks you. Uh, I'm going to turn off notifications. Uh, I don't need emails to update me. So now when you get to this screen, uh, you need to click on the bottom right hand icon and you'll see that it's got an add to Siri. Uh, now if I click on that, uh, it, you can tell it what you want it to launch with. So I'm going to use the one that it says. Well, no, I'll use, I'll use Hey Google actually. Hey Google. So that's done. And that's all you need to do. So now if we go back to the home screen and I say, Hey Siri, Hey Google. So it's asking to use the microphone, so I'm going to say OK. You can see that it's picking it up now. Let's get back to the home screen though and try that again. Hey Siri, Hey Google. Tell me about Exeter. So you can use different ways of launching it in different words. Um, so when you initially press that record button, obviously I said hey Siri, but I could have chosen other things and I've actually added some more to it because I've done this process three times now. So I can say hey Siri, assistant. Tell me about London. So I can also ask it uh, to navigate, I can also ask it weather, and it's, it just means that you've got a few more options. So when I'm driving along and I use Siri, a lot of the time I'll ask it a question I want to know the answer to, and Siri just doesn't help. Uh, Siri's brilliant for um, texting and, and setting timers and various things like that, navigation works well, but just some things you want an answer to a question, and you're driving along so you don't want to touch the device, um, you do have to unlock the device to do this, uh, but once it's unlocked, um, then it works. You've got to be fairly quick when the sound happens, um, but if you do miss it, then you can just say OK Google, and then it'll allow you to, to launch it again, and it will stay open. I don't know how long it stays open, because I haven't been playing around with it long enough. Um, but uh, let's try... Hey Siri. Assistant. Who is the President of the USA? Hey Siri, computer. Who is the Prime Minister? It doesn't always give you a long time to, uh, to basically say what you want to say. Um, so what you can do is say, OK Google. OK Google. OK Google. OK Google. Hey Google. Hey Google. OK Google. OK, Google. Hello there. How can I be of service? OK, it's not 100%. It's only just been added, um, and a few things don't seem to be that reliable. But it may be a, a way of you finding out some information um, that, uh, you know, if you're driving along and you just want to ask it a question, Siri doesn't give you the answer. You can at least launch uh, Google and see how that works. So mine's set up to respond to, hey, Google computer and assistant. So all of those work. Um, so, hey Siri, assistant. Who is the Prime Minister? Here's a summary from pm.gc.ca. The Prime Minister, Justin Trudeau, spoke with the President of the United States of America, Donald J. Trump. Hey Siri, assistant. What is the fastest Tesla? According to the Telegraph, capable of going from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 1.9 seconds, the Tesla Roadster would be the first such car ever to break the two-second mark, the entrepreneur said at a launch near Los Angeles. Hey Siri, computer. What is the heaviest animal? Blue whale, according to some information I found on Earth and World. So, 
it's not perfect, um, but uh, but it is just another add-on and another great thing about series shortcuts. So uh, thanks very much for watching. Please like and subscribe.